Have you seen the Geometry Dash cheating scandal? Yeah, I, I was trying to look for that. Who who was it? I couldn't find anything about it. There's been so many cheaters in this community. And I couldn't find the new one. Is is this it? Is it Space UK? I'm assuming it had to be, right? But then when I looked him up, it wasn't like he was the best player in Geometry Dash history. And people hyped him up as like the best Geometry Dash player. Like, when I was hearing about the story, they were treating the guy like he was the LeBron James of Geometry Dash. Michael Jordan. So it is Space UK? Okay. Thanks for the bits, pawn. The game hasn't started yet. It's starting soon. Here, I'll get, like, the gist of this situation real quick. Thanks for the subs, bud. Er, stubs. Appreciate that. In the resub crisis. Not sure, Pawn. And I haven't seen that trailer, no. So is this the evidence here? I thought this was just going to give me a general overview. So what did he do? Like, task frames or something? Oh. I'm back, bro. Things that didn't give subs, Magic Man, and the resub, Mott and Jacob. Maybe just a write-up on this, because I'm not knowledgeable enough on exactly understanding how all of that works. So it seems like a macro in order to change frame data. Is that correct? Every main list after my Sephiroth main list completion in May 8, 2022 was hacked. I lost interest in actually playing the game and wanted to see how long I could go without being caught. Hack completions included Aerial Gleam, Oblivion, Abyss of Darkness, Hallucination, and Kiyuki. Vortox made a video explaining it. Oh, it didn't come up when I looked for it. Here, hold on. He made a twit longer about everything. Thanks the resub, Thule. So this was his first taste, his gateway drug into the dark side. My completion of The Golden was accidentally no-clipped and hadn't realized it was no-clipped until 20 minutes after I beat the level. I then decided to submit the record anyway with the mindset of, oh, well, if it gets caught, whatever, I'll just quit. <laughs> Okay, I mean, that's champion mentality. To my surprise, the record was accepted, and then I never looked back. How did I hack it? I bought ZBot and recorded a macro and clicked over it. That's it. Nothing complicated, just simple clicking over a macro. This method of hacking was used for about 90% of all of my hacked completions. Holy shit. Man, there are so many people who cheat in Geometry Dash, it's crazy. Holy... What does this mean for me? I want to try and make things right, even if it's only a little thing. For all the first Victor titles I've robbed, I'll be giving the money made from the monetization from those videos back to the players who actually deserve it. I know saying sorry or doing this doesn't even come close to making up for everything I've done, but it's the least I can do. Oh, Alright, interesting. Well, better than most cheaters, I guess. Moist Moguls game starting, is it? I have I had it pulled up. It's still on break, it's on intermission. But yeah, it's about to start. Base UK stuff. He even made a twit longer just owning up to cheating and everything. It's the Wavix one. Hey, I have a Discord so This is the why I won't miss Space UK. Yeah, it looks like it. So this looks like it's a meme about the situation, and this is more of the breakdown. So just see, so... I mean, I feel like I have a decent understanding of what he did. He macroed in order to achieve the rec the records. And... To, thanks for the gift sub, Rex. I'm not sure, Crimson, they're all bad. There's not, like, a good natural disaster. The bad part of this is the revenue he stole from the people who deserved it. Oh, that's something I wanted to ask when I read his twit longer. He said he'd give back the revenue from achieving the records. Is that is there like bounties on the records, or is it just from his AdSense? 
He mentioned AdSense, but is there like a bounty for being number one on like a course? Is it Prime Small? No, just the AdSense? Okay. He's, I mean, in his twit longer, he did say he's going to give it to the runners who actually earned it. It's right there on his channel. I see the video. That's It's not that I can't find the video. It's that I didn't see it at first and went to the other channel because his is literally the last one in the search for his channel. Why is it a massive W day? Oh, we got the Moist Moguls playing today. One of the best Geometry Dash players of all time has just been exposed for hacking nearly all of their levels. This player won an award for being the best player of the year in 2022. This player was celebrated for verifying the hardest level of Geometry Dash at the time and continuing on to be every single level on the demon list, making them an official GD legend. But it was all a lie. Ladies and gentlemen, let's talk about Space UK, the now former number one that Geometry bastard. Dash player. Space UK began playing Geometry Dash in April of 2020, which is a pretty short period of time compared to most other top players who have been playing for upwards of eight years. He completed his first demon a month eight after years. starting. I didn't that know the demon game was that old. Decode, a really popular easy demon many players complete early on. Now, I want you to guess what his second demon was. Probably the Nightmare or the Lightning <laughs> Road, right? Wrong. His second demon was freaking Windy Landscape, an insane demon. And right yeah, after that, know, he got a quote-unquote 77% really. fail on Cataclysm. 77, I'm done! And if none of that was crazy enough for you, his fourth ever demon completion was a level called Wazaretta. I beat it, yes! This was a top Did he self snitch? 20 no, he got exposed because people noted, or well, at least one person claimed that the... Uh, screen at the end was smaller than it normally should be so then they went back and looked at some of his footage and realized that there was like frame delays that weren't natural and then eventually they uh pieced together that he was likely using a macro so then space uk went on twitter and he's like yeah i've been cheating like this entire time just owned up to it he said yeah, i've been using a macro uh for pretty much all of my records i just wanted to see how long i could go without getting caught so yeah, I mean, he, he owned up to everything. Who the fuck finds out that the screen is smaller than usual? Brother, I don't know. <laughs> it's also only one guy who said that, so I don't know if that's where it started. The extreme demon at the time. Meaning this guy literally beat one of the hardest demons ever after playing for like, two months. <laughs> and for his fifth ever demon, he beat the Golden which was the absolute hardest demon at the time. This obviously sounds too good to be true, but the thing is, there was no proof any of it was hacked at the time. He was seen as a prodigy just beginning his reign as the best It really does ever. seem like an easy game you can cheat in. There's already been a few high-profile GD cheaters that we've... I, I mean, I'm not a big GD guy. I, I think I've played the game maybe once or twice. But I always keep get kept up to date on, like, all scandals. And I've ironed, I, I know we covered a couple other ones. It really seems like a super easy game to cheat and get away with. Things the bits fluffy. I, I'm not sure, Fluffy. He would go on to beat extreme demons as if they were nothing for the months to come. A pretty funny moment in his career is when he beat Bloodbath in just 600 attempts. Bro, can't let go took me 600 attempts to beat. His most notable I just don't know what any of this really means, to be honest. Geometry Dash's brand new hardest demon at the time. <laughs> I can't fucking react, otherwise I'm gonna cough so much. This would be the level to finally overtake Tartarus as the top one extreme demon. And at this point, Tartarus was the hardest extreme demon for over a year before Slaughterhouse came out. As time went on, he eventually managed to beat every single level on the demon list. An absolutely incredible accomplishment. This solidified the requirements him as a to get on the demon list are very strict. Raw footage, mic recording, click or sounds, or and other shit. I should say mm. liquefied, because this would all melt down on April 25th of 2023. That was yesterday. Is the prime pharaoh. Paco, a top player who verified Silent Clubstep among other things, uploaded an exposal video on Space UK. Oh, this video pointed out that's that a the lot one we of clicks in his hardest completions were either slightly early or slightly delayed for some reason compared to the video. But the most noteworthy point Paco made is that you can hear a second click in most of his completions if you listen very closely. This second click is theorized to be him activating a bot that completes the rest of the level for him. This technology is used by some Geometry Dash YouTubers to easily showcase levels that are too hard to actually beat. This way people can just watch the levels. But Space had a different idea in mind. Using one of the bots called Zbot, 
that also added hey, that's the one that uh, click patterns in the level. Space UK owned up to you. It's comically simple. It was really hiding in plain sight. Nobody considered that Space was doing this because it was such an outdated and quite frankly silly method of hacking. After this video exposing him came out, Space UK took to Twitter and confessed to hacking many He's research from demons just because he was quote unquote element. bored. The most notable level being Acheron, the currently hardest extreme demon. Space UK hacked Acheron to become the first victor, stealing that title from all the other players trying to complete it first. Now that he's been exposed, this makes Doggy the first victor by default. Good job, Doggy. Everybody was very surprised at first, but we all thought it was kind of funny. One of the best players ever is one of the troll us, and he succeeded. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, no. It oh, got worse. I was, I was gonna Upon say. Upon further investigation, the demon list team discovered that just about every extreme demon space has ever completed was hacked, and it was all due to 64 pixels. Let me explain. I mentioned oh, this earlier is what the guy that in the chat mentioned. That Space UK was activating a bot early on in his completions to beat the rest of the level for him. Well, the bot he was using was confirmed to be Zbot, and little did we know that the developer of Zbot added a little easter egg in the textures for this bot. The level complete screen you get after beating a level is slightly altered when you use Zbot. The text that says level complete in normal Geometry Dash is 1004 pixels no, wide, that's, but that's when using Zbot, that text shrinks down that's to 940 such pixels. A fucking hard this little thing detail to may notice. have been added so that people could detect hackers, but unfortunately most people forgot about this and nobody even bothered checking Space UK's records until now. So we now know that Space UK is the biggest fraud in Geometry Dash history, all thanks to a 64 pixel difference in his level completion screen. I, even knowing that these aren't the same size, I like actually can't fucking tell. Actually, no, when they're side by side, I kind of can because uh, this hangs too far over. Or not too far over, this is too far in. Very astute. I feel like the clicking was probably enough though. Uh, w developer though for putting that in there. So yeah, he cheated all of his shit. <laughs> Number one player was a big cheater. When I looked this up though, I couldn't find anything about Space UK. Did he besides Twitter? Did he like delete everything he had? Yeah, he did. Oh, okay. Well, that would explain why it was so fucking hard to find anything. Thanks to tier one ADHD and the resub Topher and Tildren, and the resub Code Bear. Carl Jobs, that Carl Jobs said he's making a video on this soon. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh yeah, this seems right up Carl's alley. This is high-profile cheating. Links to the resub doggo and the bits duck. There's a Space UK archive. Oh. Links to give sub gushing. Bro robbed me on NR1. Oh, is that right? Were you one of the victims of Space UK here? Yeah, it's rough. He got away with it for a long time, though. Two whole fucking years. Was it two years? I thought it was uh, just a little over a year, right? I'll have to, I'd have to go back to his twit longer, but I thought he said he didn't start doing it until... Um, oh, God. Well, I already forgot the name of it. The one that he got the 77% on. No, nah, it was two years. Oof, Christ. Thanks for some Cassidy, Indoraxis, and the Give Sub Fluffy. Space is not the only one to do this. We knew he hacked a ton of easier levels in the game, which resulted in him getting a ban from the end game leaderboard. Hacking is so common among many players for people that see this as normal. Well, that's what I was saying. It really just seems like a very easy game to cheat in, because it's a hard thing to confirm. I wonder if, again, I'm not a big GD guy, I don't know too much about the game or its community at the top level or anything, but I do wonder, if you, like, investigated a lot of the top players, how many of them had similar things in their runs? Because I guarantee Space UK was not the only one. There's no way.